So let's do this. Okay, so we're going to fix the stand on this old Segway. This is generation one Segway and I have another video where I uh, show you how to mount a 3D printed plastic part to the stand and now we're going to change the stand on the Segway and I'm going to show you how to do that because I promised that I would do that. So first off you're going to need a 16 millimeter uh, case and it needs to be really 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 I don't know if you can see it thin here because there's not much space in between uh, the nut and the wheel. And also, if you have the locking uh, variety of nut, then you'll need a tall one. It needs to be tall. So first off, we'll put that one on there. And also, if you hear someone making noises in the background, it's my neighbor fixing his, his son's really controlled car. So. <laughs> and this is okay. Now we got that thing out of the way. So this is the lock thingy if you have the lock and this is just an ordinary nut. Now to get the wheel uh, away from here we need a hammer and some wood and you'll need to give it a really good whack on the side here that's how to do it <clears throat> yep okay so far so good Now, ordinary, you don't need to loosen all these nuts. You just have to loosen a couple of them, and then you can take it out on the side. But as I'm have, I have to fix fix this thing. I take them all out. I'm going to need a lot of super glue here. Yep. Sure. Which size? Yep. And that's a uh, four millimeter. One. Well, this is the old stand, and as you can see, it's not very fresh. This is the new stand, and So, one, two, two, so, look how easy that is. So now we have a new stand and it seems to work quite
quite nicely. Yep. So, okay, and to put it together again, just do the whole thing the other way around. Remember to tighten that bolt really good because, or else you will lose your wheel, and that's no fun. Thank you.